Krugan. Because they will head bash you, so it's probably not a good idea to melee a Krugan in any situation. That sounds bad. Unless they're on their okay, ass. Time. No Reaper's taking this Primark from me. Right behind you. You better be. Huh? What's going on? We're in combat. This is the other camp. Clear the camp. Okay. Oh shit. Cannonballs. Cannonballs. Throw a grenade. Get to cover. Throw a grenade for God's sake. Swap to the assault rifle, actually. Where's my assault rifle? No ammo? Are you serious? What the hell? Die. What the fuck, another one of those things, right? Shotgun again. Throw a grenade, throw a grenade. Throw a grenade at that bastard. motion. Shotgun is highly effective against armor. Very effective. So it's perfect to use against those things. What's this? Reaper blaster? Holy shit. What the hell is this? Whoa. Whoa. That was weird. Probably could you could have used that to better effectiveness. Let me just check this place out. I'm sure they can handle themselves. While I look for fat loot, because I'm a selfish, selfish bastard. Hang on. Another one. Oh my god, two of them. <laughs> Holy shit. I thought one was tough. Yeah. Try two. Shotgun, please. He's gonna come running at me. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Holy shit. I heard some band. Come at me, bro. Let's see. Chuck a grenade. Chuck a grenade. Ah, I'm taking heavy, heavy fire. You got that brute. Priority. him in the ass. Shoot you in the head. Not close enough range for that. Assault rifle. Keep that. Keep my beam. Doesn't quite reach him. Right, what have we got? Sniper rifle and hot scope. 100 XP from a med kit because we can't carry anymore. Or medi gel, whatever. Epic music playing. Oh crap, I'm taking heavy damage. Who's firing at me? Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Fuck! Take the Maddie Jail. Holy shit. Get the cover. Eat my beam. Right, where's the other bastard? There's one there. Eat my beam. Nothing behind here. Okay, pick up the ammunition. Right, they're firing over there. I don't see anybody over there. Gotta be careful. What's that? Where are they firing at? Caught in the crossfire. Oh shit. Oi. He threw a grenade at me. How dare you. Bloody cannibals. What are you doing jumping on the rock? Garrus jumping up and down the rock. Nothing behind here. No secrets. We haven't been over here. This is general. 
What was his name? General Nuisance? General Victus. General Nuisance. Yes? I'm Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Not Commander. I know mm -hmm. who you are. I can't wait to find out what brings you out here. The Carrion, yes. where did you go? Heavy Reaper unit on the right flank. I believe your exact words were, get that thing the hell off my men. Appreciate it. General, you're needed off planet. I've come to get you. It will take something beyond important for me to leave my men or my Turian brothers and sisters in their fight. Fedorian was killed. You're the new Primarch. You're needed immediately to chair a summit and represent your people in the fight against the Reapers. Totally devastated the plant. Sick. I'm Primarch of Palavan. Negotiating for the Turian hierarchy. Yes. I've spent my whole life in the military. I'm no diplomat. I hate diplomats. What's the hesitation? What makes you think you're not qualified? I'm not really a by the book kind of guy, and I piss people off. Kind of like me. been military since the Unification War. War is my life, it's in my bones. But that kind of passion is deceptive. It can make you seem reckless when you're anything but. You sound perfect. You're all, you're all I've got. Is this gonna give me renegade points? He does sound perfect. That sounds like a renegade answer, but you're all I've got sounds. I suppose we should reassure him. Oh well. War is your resume. At a time like this, we need leaders who've been through that hell. I like that. You're right. And honestly, uniting these races may take as much strength as facing the Reapers. See this devastation, Primarch? Mm. Double that for Earth. I need an alliance. I need the Turian fleet. Strength in numbers. Give me a moment to say goodbye to my men. Good. Without him down here, there's a good chance we lose this move. Without him up there, there's a good chance we lose everything. Exactly. Look at that. And they want my opinion on how to stop it? Failed CSEC officer, vigilante, and I'm their expert advisor? Think you can win this thing, Shepard? Yeah, I don't know, Garrus. But I'm sure as hell gonna give it my best shot. I'm damn sure nobody else can do it. For whatever it's worth. I'm with you. Welcome aboard. Sweet. So we've got Garrus. Are you Primarch Victus? One thing. Yes. Commander, I appreciate your need for our fleets, but I can't spare them. Not while my world is burning. But if the pressure could be taken off Palavan... That's a pretty tall order. Hmm. We need the Krogan. I can't see us winning this thing without them. Get them to help us. And then we can help you. So the Krogan next. The Krogan. Looks like your summit just got a lot more interesting. So back to the Normandy. Apologize for being so frank, Commander, but your plan feels doomed to failure. We know. We've been there before. But Madam Council, let me... I'm not the only one that feels this way. The Salarian Dalatras is livid. Some of these issues are hundreds of years old. Time to let go. Perhaps. Still, we can't help but feel that this summit is a waste of your time. And we can't afford to have it waste ours. We must focus our attention on the arrival of the Reapers. So no, the Asari will not be at your summit. Our alliance would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. Good luck, Commander. And goodbye. The Asari will not be at the summit? Admiral Hackett's available on Bitcoin. The idiots need everybody for this war. Admiral Hackett. All right, we have to speak to this dude as well. Link to Hackett. Commander, have you retrieved the Primarch for your summit? Yes, sir. But the Asari are staying on the sidelines. They'll regret that. The yeah. time for unity is now. Exactly. The Salarians will be there, though. You don't sound very optimistic. We expect the Krogan will be joining us too. 
I see. Well, then you've got your hands full, Commander. Was there something else you needed to discuss? Let's see what else we can ask him about. Um, so, the attack on Earth. Where's Earth at the minute? Have you pieced together how the Reapers hit Earth? Oh, how they hit Earth? Okay. It wasn't all that complicated, really. They searched through the relays and hit Archura Station before we knew what was happening. From there, it was a short jump to the Sol System. Earth didn't stand a chance. I'm glad we went to Mars. Sending us to the Mars Archives was a good call. Still doesn't make up for the fact that the Reapers nailed us to the wall. I sacrificed the entire second fleet to provide cover for the third and the fifth to retreat. Hell, I presided over the most devastating military defeat in human history. That was actually where humans discovered the technology to enable them to travel through space effectively. Was on Mars they found the Reaper artifacts? Or was it the... I think it was the Reaper artifacts, so they, they incorporated that into their design. Or was it Proethean? I'm not sure whether it was Proethean or Reaper technology they used. That's quite interesting. Um, so what's the strategy for the war? How do you see us winning this war, Admiral? Using that weapon I for one thing? The tip of the spear. I'm flattered, but the Normandy's just one ship. And a fast one. You can move quickly, hit a target, and leave before the enemy has time to react. That's just one battle. It's an advantage, but can it win a war? It's the larger principle that matters. We'll never defeat the Reapers in a full frontal assault, Shepard. Hmm. So I'll find their soft spots, avoid them where they're strong, and hit them where they're not. Good strategy. And when I find gaps in the armor, I'll hammer them with every soldier, ship, and bullet we've got. Good. Because it's not about winning the battles, it's about winning the war. So you win the little battles, you lose the big battles. But for every little battle you win, it can turn the tide and eventually win the war. But will that be enough? How long can we keep that up? As long as it takes. The reality is, Shepard, everything I'm doing is a delaying action for you. I'm buying us time, keeping us in the game while you gather what we need for this Protheum device. So keep at it. Alrighty. Um, so the Protheum device, that's what we need. We need the catalyst for that to be able to defeat these Reapers. So what else can you tell me about it? Has your analysis of the Protheum device turned up anything? The R appears to be right. It's a weapon of some sort. A big one. Beyond that, we really can't say, other than it's going to be a hell of a thing to try and build. Uh, it poses quite a risk, also. Do you think it's risky, building something like this when we don't even know what it does? To be honest, the thing scares the hell out of me. But the Reapers have forced our hand. Two centuries ago, scientists faced the same problem in the Second World War. They weren't sure what the atomic bomb hmm, might do. The atomic bomb, yeah. Some thought it could even ignite Hiroshima. Earth's atmosphere, but they did it anyway. Wow. They thought it could ignite Earth's atmosphere, but they did it anyway? Wow. That is just craziness, and they allowed that to happen. Unbelievable. And war made it legitimate to do that, or acceptable to do that. I suppose it's the same sort of situation here. Um, so, we actually do have a Protheon on board now. But unfortunately it doesn't actually know anything about the weapon. So we're still risking quite a lot building it. Anyway, what about Cerberus? Any updates on Cerberus? There's still the wild card here. Hitting the archives on Mars suggests they're after the same thing we are. A way to defeat the Reapers. The elusive man implied as much. You'd think we'd be on the same side, now more than ever. Cerberus has never played by the rules as we know them. I don't know what their agenda is, but it has nothing to do with humanity's best interests. Hmm. Controlling the Reapers. The elusive man talked about controlling the Reapers. Yeah, he wants to do that. seem to think that's how we win this. It's wrong. Dead Reapers are how we win this. Doesn't mean he won't try. I saw your report on that Cerberus soldier you found on Mars. If the elusive man is good at one thing, it's finding new ways to subvert science. It's never worked for him before, and it won't now. I think that's about everything we can talk to you about. Yep, okay. Well, see you later. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Hack it out. I will hack it out. To land. That's what we have to do. Hack it out. 
pretty funny. There's Primarch Victus. I thought that was Garrus. Commander, thank you for allowing me the use of your ship and for going along with this plan. Garrus said he had to attend to the Normandy's weapon systems. Ooh. Something about calibrations. Again, I thought he did that Sounds in Mass Effect like too. Garrus. Yeah. I'm sorry to say the Asari Counselor won't be joining us. She thinks there's too much bad blood with the Krogan. Hmm. She may be right, but there'll be a lot more blood. Real blood, if we don't try. I'll try and convince her. And when you put it that way. The sooner we have this summit, the sooner we'll know. Is there something else I can help you with? Um, let's see. Can you get any tour and help for Earth? I understand this is a difficult time for you, Primarch, but Earth can't survive without reinforcements. Can I still count on your help? If the Krogan help us on Palavan, then I give you my word. That's good, that's good. So we can save Earth. Uh, what's... What can you tell me about your new duties? How is it being the Primarch? Not what I imagined. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away, reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be with my men, so there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I can relate. I understand. Leaving Earth to save it. It's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of you. You never asked to be a leader, yet your people will die if you refuse. We find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. Um, what about the Palavan situation? How are things on Palavan? The casualty reports are staggering. The Reapers are using our own tactics against us. Destroy the enemy with overwhelming force. I've seen hmm. the same on Earth. The strategist in me admires their brutality. The Turian in me knows I'm watching the destruction of 15,000 years of civilization. My civilization. Well, it happened to the... Protheans 50,000 years ago. 